Like I usually wear something on my head because uh, whether it's a towel when I'm working hard or whether it's a hat like this. I bought loads of these at a recycle store and they were like 50 yen, 100, 100 yen, 200 yen for the purpose of making videos. Uh, but I, like I wear a hat usually because if I don't, with this beard, I look something out of the 18th century. And it's a, some people it's a little bit off-putting unless I'm in character, like Darwin, for example. So I do like to put something on top of my head. Uh, you know, also, also there's the glare aspect. I don't want to be really blinding anyone. But like this is this is also a hat I've got. You know, because some people have accused me of being a sanctimonious. So this is my Archbishop's hat. I hope to be making a video soon with the uh, with the Archbishop, and it'd be nice to have an actress joining me. Anyway, so today's video was going, is about uh, my son Enzo having a baby in Japan. So we were, I asked my wife about starting a family and uh, she said, well, leave it one year and make sure everything's okay. Like she didn't trust me, see what, how bad it could get. But so we went ahead and we decided to have a, a child. What I didn't know, and maybe a lot of people don't know that haven't had children, is that the window for getting pregnant is very, very small. That's not a euphemism, by the way. It's a, a, time, a matter of time, and it's between 24 hours and 36 hours. That's all the time you've got. And the best way to do it is, is by temperature. I'm not preaching to the people that have had kids. I'm talking to people that, that haven't had kids or are thinking about having kids. So, so when you take the take the temperature every morning so when the temperature spikes one degree above normal that's when you've got to put the the cake in the oven okay so once you've done that okay if you know so you, so you do it for a couple of days three days and uh, in the, in the morning because that's when the temperature you first notice the temperature rise uh, and then, like I said, when it stays at 38, that means you've been successful. So you can know n the next day if your wife is pregnant just by checking the temperature. So if it stays at 38, the job's done, it's cooking. Okay. But we did this. So using this method, we got, we got pregnant. My wife got pregnant within, uh, sorry, the second month we tried it. So it was, and the average, the average for babies is actually about 10 months, something like that. So if you can get it using this method, I think you can get a baby quickly by just doing the temperature method. Uh, so I, I named him, I named him uh, Enzo because he was the big boy in Le Grand Blue John Reno film, and Enzo, Enzo was a big boy in the film. And in, now in real life, my son Enzo is very, very big. He's 15, and this is his, this is his shoe. Now that this is a size 12, and he's 15 years old, he's about six foot. He's six foot two, and he's been in, so, uh, and he's in the range between 90 and 100 kilograms. So he is quite quite a big lad. Uh, so he did live up to his name, Enzo, the name we gave him, because, uh, like I said, I chose I chose my son's name, and my wife chose my daughter's name, Taya which is, if you look at it in English, it's T. And T, she named her Taya because she, for a strong British T. And as it turns out, she is also quite a Genki child, very strong, she, she was doing karate. And so she's a, she's a tough little kid with the heart of gold. Okay, so that is my uh, video on having a baby in Japan. And then one trying for kids out there, Good luck. Please try using that method. Bye-bye.